Yeah, 35 29 overtime. October 17th. Yeah, it was OT. October 17th. Yeah, I think it was City Land. Yeah. The going over last year's Patriots, <laughs> right, why Patriots not? schedule. <laughs> yeah, so. that's, that was weird that we went back and <laughs> yeah. not. Whatever. <laughs> Welcome <It's>, back. <laughs> well, training camps open now this yeah. week. Yeah, I think some have already started. By okay. by Monday, I think everybody's in. So yeah, wow. Well, football's almost here. And you know, in, in like a matter of like a week and a half, they'll have like week one of the There'll preseason pre-season games. Yeah. Season kicks off right here on NBC. It's, in case you're wondering, it, it does right on a Thursday on night. On a Thursday September night. Yeah, it'll be seventh, uh, eighth, ninth, something like that. Uh, Rams and Bills. Bills. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. It's September wow. 8th. You know how I know? Because I wanted to take the 9th off. Yeah, which so Sharon, Sharon's already game. off, right? No, but no, none of us can. We have a big day on the 9th. Oh, oh, we do. We do. Oh, this is big news show. to me. We got to catch up. Big I, sh- we'll, big show. we'll catch up in the commercial break. <laughs> um, a little, pa- little patchy fog out there this morning, but that's about it. Hopefully it sticks around for a while and suppresses some of the heat for you, but it's pretty warm. We're starting out around 70 degrees. Dew points are up there, too close to 70 oppressive levels. Haven't had much of this air this season. Get used to it, folks. The next several days look really uncomfortable. Hot and humid air mass working up the eastern seaboard with a trigger coming in this afternoon, expecting some strong thunderstorms to erupt, mostly after two o'clock. Looks like about three o'clock in New Hampshire, closer to four or five in western and southern Maine and then about five to eight as you go through eastern and down east Maine. That fog burns off to hazy sun. It's already warm. It's already stuffy out. Midday, triple H's. It'll feel like 90 if it doesn't hit it, and it will hit 90 near the New Hampshire border and into the Granite State. We're also going to have more of a breeze today. It's going to be pretty strong out of the south, directly off of the water, which means it's going to be super muggy. This afternoon, as the front moves through, expect some strong storms to march through. They will be over by sunset, which is pretty good, but they aren't going to offer up much relief. Unfortunately, the humidity will stay pretty high. Comes down a tad tomorrow, but not a ton. Timing on the storms, 3 to 7. Primary concern, gusty wind, hail, and torrential rain. There is, however, a small tornado risk with these storms as they come through. So we'll be checking on that radar for you all afternoon. Mike Slifer is also with us this morning, and he'll go over more tornado stats for you later on. So stick around for those. High temperatures in Maine, especially close to the ocean, will be kept down a little bit because of that south wind. We'll be about 80 to 85 along the coast. Inland, it's 85 to almost 90. Waterville and Lewiston, 88. Look at Freiburg, though, 93. Sanford, 90 degrees. Concord, New Hampshire, 94. It'll also be around 90 as you get farther away from that ocean. Rangeley, Greenville, Millinocket, and Caribou. It's going to be a hot one. Tomorrow, the front falls apart after it clears the coastline. Tomorrow is going to be a beautiful summer day, but just slightly less humid. You probably won't notice it because the heat will be with us still up around 90, so they sort of offset each other. And then over the weekend, more classic summer. Hazy, hot, and humid both Saturday and Sunday, and pretty much thunderstorm-free, too. Looks like our next round holds off until Sunday night and Monday as this front comes through. There should be some relief behind that from both heat and humidity. Small crafts are up today. The seas two to four, the winds cranking out of the south later this afternoon. So very warm out there with highs in the mid 80s. Expect strong thunderstorms later on as well. Tomorrow it's around 90, sunny and hot. Saturday, we've got the dog days of summer. That should be a 9-0, not an 8-0. Sunday also very hot around 90 degrees. There'll be some evening storms approaching, but most of the weekend, as I mentioned, is thunderstorm free. And then we get that next round on Monday, and that should break the humidity. And the middle of next week looks glorious. So there you go. Good to know. Next week's looks nice, huh? Yeah. Are you off? A little bit. Little, yeah. Just, yeah. A, just a little, little bit. Yeah. Little bit. <laughs> All right. Good for you. Focus on August. <laughs> I am. <laughs> All right. Thank you. <laughs>